Hey guys, it's Michael Kummer here and in this video I want to discuss how Carol, an AI powered exercise bike, can help you with your weight loss goals. Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to this channel and you click on the little alert button so you get notified when I publish more fitness videos like this. I'm a firm believer that weight loss is a simple byproduct of a healthy lifestyle. In other words, I do not necessarily encourage to make weight loss the primary goal of what you're doing and what lifestyle choices you're making. If you're making the right lifestyle choices as far as exercise, sleep and diet are concerned, you will be losing weight automatically and you don't have to necessarily focus just on that. Now if you're new to Carol and you've just stumbled across this high intensity stationary exercise bike, you might be asking yourself the question, how can a bike that you only need to ride for about 24 minutes per week can help you with your health and weight loss goals? And so that's the core question that I'm trying to answer in this video today. So let's talk about Carol real quick. Let me give you an overview in case you're not very familiar with the platform. Carol is an AI powered, high intensity, stationary exercise bike that can help you achieve your health and weight loss goals with very minimal time investment. And that's what makes it different from spinning bikes, from air bikes, and from other types of exercises that require a much greater time investment and more effort at the end of the day than what Carol does. And I encourage you to check out my Carol review video so you get an idea of, of how it works and, and what the benefits are, etc. But just in a nutshell, let me briefly tell you about the main exercise regimen of Carol and how it works and why it's so effective. So the classic workout on Carol takes about eight minutes. That's a very short amount of time and you only have to perform that exercise regimen about three times a week and all of that is backed by scientific evidence. I'll give you a quick overview of how that works but if you want to do some more reading and look at all the research I'm going to link all of that below. But basically the way it works is when you hop on Carol, you do a warm up, takes about two minutes, and then you perform a 20 second high intensity all out sprint. And during that sprint, Carol and its AI power measures your input, your heart rate, your decline, because you cannot, you know, pedal as fast as you can for a very long time, within a few seconds you start declining, your power input starts declining, and as it does, Carol dynamically adjusts the resistance so it's maximum effort for you and it triggers all of those chemical reactions in your body that otherwise you could only trigger during significantly longer workouts and that's particularly true for the emptying of your glycogen stores which are mechanisms to store sugar in your muscle and liver tissue and those glycogen stores get emptied when you ride on Carol. So you do the 20 second sprint, you have a recovery, then you do another sprint that's super intensive, and then you have a cool down period. But overall, you only spend about eight minutes on the bike, out of which only 40 seconds are very intense. And because it's so short, the time that you're really doing something, your heart rate stays up only for a very short period before it recovers quickly so you don't even sweat. And I know this sounds crazy and why would that even work but trust me there is a lot of scientific evidence and case studies on why it works and how it works exactly and we'll dive into that here in a little bit as well. But the bottom line is Carol is super intensity type of workout. It doesn't take you very long and you only have to do it three times a week. And one of the key aspects of Carol is that the motivational factor is so high. Because think about it, you know, if, if you're not in the best physical shape you could be and you would like to lose some weight and someone tells you, well, you have to go to the gym for two hours, five times a week. There are a lot of hurdles and there are a lot of reasons that I'm, you know, just 
based on the fact that we are humans, you know, we put in front of us and say, well, today I can't because, you know, I'm stressed out, I'm sleepy, I'm, you know, I haven't eaten well, or whatever the case might be, there's always a reason why you don't want to do this, especially if you know tomorrow I have to do it again, and the day after I have to do it again, and it takes you always a lot of time. There's a great time investment in doing that. And so with Carol, knowing that you only have to do it three times a week for eight minutes, it's an incredible tool at your disposal to keep doing that. The motivational factor is so high and that's one of the main reasons why Carol is so effective at what it does. It provides the same benefits as a 45 minute run in only eight minutes and because the chances that you continue using it are so high is one of the reasons why it's so effective at allowing you to achieve your goals, be it weight loss, be it overall improvement of health or whatever the case might be. So let's talk about some of the evidence of why this works, starting with uh, some of the case studies. And there is one case study from Ulrich. He is the co-founder of Carol. Uh, I met Ulrich uh, about a year ago in the beginning of 2019 at a trade show where he introduced me to Carol. And I didn't know how he looked before. Obviously, I only found out later that he lost a significant amount of weight and he lost 22 pounds in only 12 weeks riding on Carol. So there were two things that he did. For breakfast, he switched to uh, bulletproof coffee and bulletproof coffee is basically coffee with added fat. So butter, cream, coconut uh, fat or MCT oil maybe. So basically a fat fortified coffee, if you will. So he had that for breakfast and he rode Carol three times a week using that eight minute protocol and he lost 22 pounds in only 12 weeks. He documented all of that because it was so incredible and uh, I'm gonna link that down below if you wanna check it out. The second case study, which was more of a formal scientific study uh, with controlled in a controlled environment was a group of sedentary people who used Carol for eight weeks and during those and they didn't change anything else. They didn't exercise more, they didn't eat any different. They just wrote Carol in addition to doing what they've always been doing. And those individuals lost on average 3% body fat and 3% waist circumference in only eight weeks doing Carol. So what I'm trying to say here is that there is clear evidence, both anecdotal from you know, individual case studies, as well as scientific evidence that the Carol protocol works in helping you with weight loss and improving your health markers overall. And most importantly, you know, it's not about doing it for eight weeks and then calling it quits and going back to sitting around all day. No, it's about using Carol to get where you wanna be and then maintain it. And it's so easy to maintain it with Carol because it doesn't take a lot of time. It takes you eight minutes, three times a week. That's 24 minutes of time investment. You don't even sweat, so you don't have to take a shower afterwards, etc., and change clothes. You can do it in the office if you like, in your lunch break. And that's what makes Carol so incredibly effective. Now, if you wanna speed up your fat loss and your weight loss even more, in addition to riding Carol, you can do a couple of other things that support that whole effort. And one is you can start on a high fat, low carb diet, such as the ketogenic diet. You can look at my ultimate guide to find out more. You can do intermittent fasting, meaning skipping meals or not eating during certain times of the day to really help with your body starting to use its own body fat and burn its own body fat for energy instead of the food that you eat. The other thing to pay attention to is sleep. People who don't sleep well are more likely to be overweight and obese. So take care of your sleep, make sure you have a consistent bedtime and wake time as well, and really focus on quality sleep and enough sleep overall to speed up that fat loss and weight loss process. The other thing is to manage stress. Um, stress and especially chronic stress can get in the way of losing weight. And that's because of hormonal changes that occur when you are stressed. Like, you know, when you're stressed, your cortisol levels are high and that triggers certain chemical reactions in your body that might make it harder to lose weight. And so manage your stress, practice deep breathing. Um, obviously exercise is a great way to manage stress. So you, you know, besides the three times a week that you ride on Carol using that 
super intensity protocol. You can also just you know, sit on it and, and ride it in free ride mode, so to say, just to get a little bit of a sweat in, to start moving and to relieve stress if you know, riding a bike for half an hour helps you really stress. Yeah, and that was pretty much it. So again, Carol is highly effective in helping you with improving your health markers and losing weight and especially losing body fat is an important byproduct of that process. Don't get too hung up on, on you know, stepping on a scale every day and then measuring your progress. That's very often counterproductive. Just look in the mirror and if you like what you see, if you like the progress that you see, and you will see that progress if you just write Carol three times a week, then that's really all that matters. Um, I typically, I don't even have a scale anymore at home because I look in the mirror, if I like what I see, I'm happy, you know, that, that's all that matters. It doesn't matter what the scale says, especially because as you keep exercising, um, you might grow muscle tissue, you know, and so that might cause a temporary weight gain. I've gained weight over the past year, but not because I've gotten more body fat, but because I've, you know, improved my and grown my muscle tissue. So don't get too hung up on, on the scale. But that's really it. If you wanna try out Carol, make sure you use my code MK150. That gets you 150 bucks off Carol. And check out my review videos. Check out some of my articles that I've written that go into much more detail on the scientific evidence and the reason why those protocols work so well on Carol and why you cannot easily replicate them on other types of bikes. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, this button seems to be working as well. Until next time.